let's do it. <笑>あ、さすがに厚着しすぎじゃねえかこれ。<笑><笑><笑> <笑>あ、ありがとうな。あの子変わったね。あいつは本当の死神になったんじゃ。ルーソーリ。死神を踏み越えた本当の死神にの。はい。黒崎さん。わかりましたが、お気をつけて。なあ、うららさん。俺が行くまで持たせてくれ。俺が必ず何とかする。わかりました。Let's get it. Superman in this bitch. Let's go. ついてくるがいい。これより敗北者の初段を行う。あいや、見えるか。天秤が傾くのが。よいく。ダンブロ。その魂が持つ知識も能力も全て。陛下のお力となるのだ。陛下の決定を仰ぎ、シリフトを魂に刻み込まれたお前も逃れる術はない。戦い続け、魂を吸収し続けなければ、陛下は。よ。怖い。寂しい。エストゥルソークリピアンドパーフェクト。マッチアップ
I become the sword. <laughs> I'm currently dead. Temporarily kill my body. That's absurd. That's exactly what I'm thinking. Pay attention, my guy. Blood freezes. Make it to 50. Damn! Absolute zero, my friend. For four seconds. <laughs> Oh, I remember this fight, man. <laughs> Gotta get back to normal. Warm the body back up. They don't give me a backstory on this guy? Life is so inconvenient. Come on, Rukia. That's creepy as hell, man. <laughs> I didn't remember that Byakuya came in. It's like, brother man, I'm him. I am him. Too late for who? I'm just in my Shikai state, my guy. What do you mean? <laughs> It's the normal. We just in here with the normal things right now. <笑>うーん。うーん。うーん。うーん。うーん。うーん。うーん。うーん。うーん。うーん。うーん。うーん。うーん。うーん。うーん。うーん。うーん。うーん。うーん。うーん。うーん。うーん。うーん。うーん。
Let's talk about it for a little bit, man. I'm hyped. I'm hyped, man, because no matter what people say, you know what I'm saying? I know a lot of people out there right now is they they have because they they grew up in a different era. Like I was introduced to anime pretty late. I was introduced to the big 3 pretty late after it was going on, right? So in general, I might have a different perspective than some, but you have these you know Gen Z I would say that is getting into anime now and saying that this anime is better than that. But they don't understand, man. They don't understand the big three. I'm glad that Bleach decided to come back to finish up, finish this art, get it animated, and give us an anime version of what happened. Because, um, of course, Bleach kind of left a bad taste in your mouth if you're just an anime-only watcher, right? In my opinion. I didn't necessarily like the last arc that came after, you know, um, I don't remember what the arc is called, but you guys know who I'm talking about, um, with, you know, Ichigo getting back his Soul Reaper powers, because I don't know what the hell they were trying, I don't know what was happening, <laughs> you know what I mean? It wasn't as entertaining, it was cool to watch, don't get me wrong, but it didn't live up to the, to the hype in my opinion. Um, so, of course, we're always wondering, like, if we were ever going to get the Thousand Year Blood War animated for all these years. You know, because I don't know why it took so long. As I said, I don't keep up with anime news. I don't keep up with, like, studios and stuff like that and what they're going through and stuff like that. Because throughout all that time, a lot of that time as well, Studio Periot still was doing, they were doing Naruto. So I don't understand why they couldn't do both at the same time because they were doing both at the same time at one point. So it was kind of weird that, you know, it took this long, but it's here. So they can, all these new people can enjoy greatness if they've actually watched the Bleach series and get a finale if you will, because I know there's another arc after this arc as well that is going on in the manga. I'm not sure, but I'm not reading it, so I don't I don't know. I know there is um, another arc. I don't remember what it's called, but for the longest, we've been waiting for this, and I don't care what nobody says. Even though people might, you might have these other shows that are really good that we watch, that I've watched over the years as well the big three is just kind of untouchable to me you know i mean barring dragon ball outside of dragon ball naruto bleach and one piece even though a lot of people don't like boruto you know what i'm saying i like it a lot because i read it i don't actually watch the anime that much i only watch specific episodes to see how they animate it because i think the anime is in some ways, it's not that great. You get what I'm saying? In so, in majority of it is not that great because it's just it's plagued with too many too much filler, so people don't want to get into it um, that much. So hopefully, the second part now that we've into the time skip of Boruto and and going into coming out in a couple of weeks. I I think it's next week. Not a couple of weeks, but next week the chapter the new chapter after the time slip is going to drop and Boruto is kicking ass right now. They're kicking ass right now. I'm glad I'm able to watch or even read the big three in some capacity because these animes are trendsetter animes. A lot of other animes take their DNA from these three animes that were just super popular, right? So... I mean, I'm a big One Piece fan. Gear 5 just dropped um, in the anime, right, last week, continuing this week um, as well. And also, we have this for Bleach, anime for this, going hard as well every week. And then we have, of course, Boruto continuing the, the legacy of Naruto, right? So... 
pretty cool stuff. I'm happy to say the big three is in some ways taking over, even though I know it's lost a lot of fans when it comes on to Barto as well, right? And I'm just happy to be one of those people that can say I have, I spent a year, like a year and a few months catching up to, to One Piece because I had stopped watching it. And if you have not seen my live streams of that, go check it out on the channel. Um, of course, go to my Terabyte Reacts channel and check out my reactions, um, the live reactions to those um, episodes, man. Great stuff. Just catching up. But Bleach. But Bleach. These were two really good episodes, man. I really enjoyed um, watching these two episodes of seeing the greatness of Renji. You know, um, Renji's not my favorite character by any means. But he has his moments. He has his moments. I want to see these guys get their ass whooped. I... I when I was reading the manga for this, I never liked these guys, the Quin the Quincy's. I never liked them, cause I thought that Ishida was the only Quincy left, and he was a likable guy because he became friends with Ichigo and stuff like that. But all these other Quincy's, man, it's just like, you know what I mean? Like you want to feel sorry for them because they they kind of like the scorn of the society. But they just make themselves so unlikable. You know what I'm saying? They make themselves... I mean, when somebody like Aizen don't even want to work with you, bro, like, you know there's something wrong. Because <laughs> Aizen is like the ultimate evil dude, right? And he don't want nothing to do with you as an evil dude. Like, you know, you, you know? Um, so I, I'm hyped to see these fights because these fights... Ultimately, a lot of the stuff, of course, we've never seen before. Like in this in last episode here with Rukia unleashing her her Bankai for the first time, right? And of course, I we know, I know a lot of people is going to be like, well, why didn't we see their training and all of this other stuff? I don't really need to see the training. Right, because we know the, the the author and the mangaka knows that these are characters that people like. They know the popularity of their characters. They know that, um, you know what I'm saying? It, it's like when I thought that Byakuya, Byakuya died. Byakuya is like my second favorite character in the series um, beyond Ichigo, right? And trust me, when I read that chapter, it nearly brought me to tears because he was like, he was a huge inspiration in the overall story, not only for, for Rukia and, and, and Renji, but also um, for Ichigo himself because he's the one that caused Ichigo to go learn to unleash his Bankai. And, right, and who can forget that moment? It's one of the most iconic moments in the entirety of Bleach. When Ichigo, the first time he used his Bankai against Byakuya, right? And how the animation was so nice, right? One of the most iconic moments, goosebumpy moments of Bleach. So, when I thought that he was dead, man, I was like, yo, Ichigo about to go crazy. And then he got his ass whooped, <laughs> right? But in, in any case, it's just... I'm just happy to be watching Bleach again. Just seeing Rukia unleash his Bankai. Renji learning the, you know, the right name for his Bankai. And fully bringing out um, his Bankai, man. And just uh, obliterates Superstar, right? Obliterates him. Like, these guys are getting taken care of in one episode. Even though they're not really really dead because they're they're um if you want to call it their race she goes back to yuha but at the same time these fights just seeing these bankai that we've never seen i'm hopefully they don't do certain ones that i'm looking for in just one episode i think some of them do need to be more than one episode but a lot of them are like one hit from the bankais and they die 
right? So I think there are some longer fights coming up that I think needs more than one episode to actually be done. I don't want these one-hit bonkais, right? Um, these are some of the one-hits, so they're kind of getting, in a way, getting those out of the way. Because, of course, you know, um, talking about Rukia, like, she, she doesn't, she can't fight. It's like a... Um, Urbanka, in, to me, to explain it in kind of like layman terms, it's like an insta-freeze, right? It's like an insta-freeze. It, um, because uh, even in that moment, I'm wondering, how is it that Biakia doesn't get affected by it? Because, you know what I'm saying? Like, it, it, that was kind of weird, too. Because it's like an insta-freeze that happens when she transform into her bankai she can't even announce her bankai bro she can't even announce it because herself become frozen in the moment so it's like and she has to take her time and get it back down just like how she did her shikai right she from getting from absolute zero right she has to take her time and warm herself back up and bring herself back to life if you will right because no human can exist at those temperatures. Crazy, right? So um, the reason why I love her Bankai so much is because she looks so nice. But she can't do it. <laughs> but she can't move around <laughs> with her Bankai. So pretty cool stuff, man. Love it. Anyways, guys, let me stop gushing over Bleach. Can't wait for the next episode. Um, Ichigo is on his way back. Um... I'm pretty sure they're gonna show some flashbacks when he start when he starts fighting. You know what I'm saying? They're gonna show some some flashbacks of you know how he completed the training and and, and stuff like that um, because there's more to it. There's so much more. This is not the last you will see. This is not the last you will see of the Soul King and 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 furthermore the Soul Kingdom as well. Um, so just keep an eye out there. There's still so much more to come in this arc that is going to be super exciting. And I'm happy, man. So hopefully you guys are too. Love you guys, man. Leave a like, leave a comment. If you ever see this on YouTube, <laughs> I'll see you guys next time. I'm out. Peace.